New Year with one of the hottest teams in Cincinnati. The Cyclones are hosting a New Year's Eve game tonight for families. And here to tell us about that is our buddy Everett Fitz. You Fitz, good to see you. Good morning. Good to see you again. Exciting times. Yes. Let's, let's just start with the team who are just killing it right now. Yes, we are in first place. This is the first time this late in the season since we won the championship back in 2010 that we've That's been in first awesome. place this late. So uh, tonight against Toledo is actually going to be the top two teams in the division going at it tonight. Very cool. So it's going to be a very exciting game. We're winning, which is always good. Yeah. Uh, the organization, the team is happy. The new coach Matt Thomas has been doing a really good job. I remember team, you brought so. him in earlier yeah, in the year. Earlier in the he year, was yeah. great. Yeah, he yeah, was great. He, he's been loving it. And, and the guys, it, it's it, the culture now around that team is you're expecting to win. It's one of those things where yep. when you win, it's like, okay, we won next game because now you're expecting it. So that's something that's uh, is, is been a really good positive change for us this year. Culture of winning is a very, very mm -hmm. important thing. And everyone say, says since least. he wants a winner. So you've got you've got the winning returning now down yep. at US Bank Arena. Very cool. Very cool. <laughs> now, you know, a lot of people are thinking about what are they going to do around town mm -hmm. for a New Year's Eve celebration. They're thinking they're going to go to Fountain Square mm -hmm. or Winterfest is doing anything up at Kings Island. You guys have a special thing on the ice tonight. Let's talk about it. Well, yeah, if you want to stay dry and stay yeah. warm, <laughs> yeah. come uh, down to US Bank Arena. We've got a special 605 game here tonight. <coughs> Excuse me. And uh, our post game fireworks show. And we've done this now for a few years. And the first time that I saw this, I was I was shocked because I, I thought this was going to be just bottle rockets and sparklers. Couple but sparklers. Yeah. Th th this yeah. is an actual, factual, uh, legit fireworks show put on by Queen City Pyro. They do a great job job for us. Um, and yeah, it, it's a family friendly event and you know the Cyclones. I mean, we're yep. all about bringing out the families and, and, and getting more of that community involvement in. And uh, for us to be able to do a, a six o'clock game, you can bring the fans down to bring the family down. Um, you can still get the kids off of the neighbors uh, or the babysitters and have an adult New Year's Eve celebration for yourself. Oh, so you're ringing it in early with you guys. Yes. So it's not like you're starting the game at six and you're going to hang out. No, until no, 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 no. We're, like we're starting it at six o'clock and a lot of folks wonder what time we'll be out of there. Game usually will last about two and a half hours, two hours okay. and 15 minutes. So Nice. Uh, with the fireworks show, you should be out of there by about 9 o'clock tonight. How many years have you guys done this now? Uh, I believe this is our seventh year we've done this. Is it really? Yes, so it's, it's been quite a while. Good and response then, great obviously. Response. And, and at least in the, the three years that I've been here now, this is my fourth year here, in the three previous years that I've been here, our attendance has gone up each of the last uh, three New Year's Eve games. Very so cool. it's been fantastic for us. Okay, educate me a little bit. How yes. much of the season do we have left? So we've got, uh, let's see, we're at game 31 tonight. Okay. So we've got a little bit more than half the season left to go. Okay. And a lot cool. of home games coming up second half of the year. A lot of major uh, promotions as well coming up. Too. I was going to say, any big ones you want to mention yeah, before we so get out of here? Next week, you've got Throwback Night or Throwback Weekend, actually. It used to be a Throwback Night, now it's a Throwback Weekend. Nice. $10 tickets, dollar beers, hot dogs, soda, and pizza, both games Friday and Saturday. And we'll do our teddy bear toss uh, to help benefit the oh, police department. Love that. So we'll be coming in later in the week and talking about that with uh, Sergeant Tim Fritz. But uh, yeah, that's our, our next biggest event coming up next weekend. So back to back, huge weekends for the Cyclones. You can bring Tim back with you, too. Huh? Oh, absolutely. Yeah, he's all right. He's, yeah. he's okay. He's, yeah, he's, all right. he's a good guy. It's always good to see you. <laughs> good seeing you, too, sir. Happy New Year, my friend